Upon hearing that she had breast cancer, fear gripped her heart, but she did not flinch. Her only fear was to leave her young children behind. Juliet Mills Lutroit was diagnosed with breast cancer at the age of 40 when she knew her work wasn't done as a mother. From an intense feeling of distress to heartache, Juliet fought her way through it all. Here's her story. The fear of leaving my children, the fear of leaving my family. I was going to ask you that. Yeah, the fear of leaving my family. But, you know, I've always been the type of person who believes that death is a beautiful part of life. Because when you appreciate the fact that you will die someday, you live better. So I've never been afraid of dying. I was never afraid of dying. I was afraid of leaving my kids abruptly. Although she was devastated when doctors told her she had breast cancer, Juliet fought her fears and stood tall through it all. Her husband had traveled when she was diagnosed and when he returned, they both sought second opinions on what to do. Juliet describes her journey as long and confusing. She cried, she prayed, she did everything anyone would when they are in distress. But what kept her going was her love for life. There are a series of tests that needs to be done one being the mammogra mammography, one being the biopsy, then the doctor will conclude whether there is anything at all. Don't start a funeral before you get to the hospital, I beg you. And at that point, listen, it's like anything else in life. If you're sick, there are uh, protocols to what you have to do to get better. Let Allow the doctors to do their work and then stay positive when you're positive with everything you feel better the medication you take works better so stay that stay prayerful do not lose your connection with god but be careful of the advice the people around you give you because sometimes they will kill you more than help she says although she's a prayerful person she did everything her doctor asked her to and she believes that's what's kept her alive. With your four fingers, you can easily put one hand behind you and check your breast. In a circular mode, you go through, you push into your breast cage and you check your breast. If you're not getting your period, once a month, you can do so. Now, when you do it every month, you are going to realize that your fingers have a memory and they will remember your breast tissue. So that if anything new comes up, you know this is different. Now, we're talking about women, but 10% of the world population of men get it as well. So I will urge the men to also check their breasts once every three months. Juliet wants women to regularly look out for lumps in their breasts. I've met patients whose husbands found their lump because they were sharing an intimate moment and the husband was who found their lumps. So the wives and girlfriends out there, please let your husbands and boyfriends play with those tatas. Sometimes they are the ones who find the lump. So it is important. Now, that's one. When you find a lump, it doesn't mean you have breast cancer. What it means is you need to have it checked. So go and have it checked. 